the latest with the SEC Ripple appeal, and I'll give you a hint, it's looking good. Along with a massive hack out there promoting a rug pull, what's new in crypto? Along with the juiciest sector in crypto earning people tons of money. Due to the graphic nature of this program, listener discretion is advised. Hola, dudes and chicks, just got done working out, and look at the puppy, and watch how fast he is. Hi, buddy, how are you doing? Oh, Hi, Vader, what a... Good, good boy. But you know the deal, your comments come first. Drop me some hot, some spicy, maybe I'll share it in the next video. XRP Ripple SEC Talk, ooh, can't wait to share it with you. User UM says, hey Klaus, I just heard that the Bank of Canada is gonna drop the interest rates again in September. What the fuck is going on with America's Trudeau's lemonade stand went bankrupt, but they still managed to drop rates three times. Seriously, Canada leading the charge on getting the rates back down. The faster a country can get rates down, the faster that country can grow. Why? Because it's cheaper to grow when you've had three rate cuts. The United States hasn't had a single one. Did you roam over cook the turkey? Oh, alcoholic click hanging out with us. Thank you for the support, sir. Says six zeros is a whale, in my opinion. I think a lot of us would agree with that. Hottest sector in crypto, earning the most money. Oh, girlfriend, do I got a story for you? Bitcoin sitting at 6,450. ETH is 2640, while BNB's at 561. Soul ETF next. Doesn't seem to be doing much for Soul. 142. XRP. We're going to talk about a lot of XRP price at the end. Sitting at 60 cents. I'm glad XRP is holding. But first, BTC dominance hits 56%. What does it mean? It means that as the turmoil grows, more people flock into BTC because it's a store of value play. Seriously, it's the inflation play. As long as inflation is a problem and as long as countries are doing money printer go burr, there's a reason to hedge with BTC. So it doesn't really shock me that this is happening. Now, what's the effect on the market? We know what it is. BTC tugs the market, but we've noticed it's not tugging the alt proportionately as much. So like if BTC goes up 15%, maybe it's tugging up some of our favorites only 5, 6, 7%. Want to learn more about dominance? Ooh, safe words as well. As always, any article you see in this video will be linked in the description below. A great hack? Yes. McDonald's Instagram account hacked to promote some Grimace coin. Oh, girlfriend, you know we all love that Grimace shit. Grimace shake going crazy AF. McDonald's official Instagram page was briefly hacked by a crypto scammer who said they rug pulled 700 worth of Solana from unsuspecting fans. And remember, the reason they're targeting Solana... It's because recently Solana has really been pumping with their extra layered stuff, right? All their, their meme coins on there, right? Lots of action. So when there's money flowing somewhere, people want a piece of it. Since the rise of crypto over the last few years, increasing number of highly filed social media pages have been hacked by scam artists. The latest to suffer from a crypto hack is one of the most iconic, McDonald's. The restaurant briefly lost access to his Instagram page. And guess what? Sorry, you have been rug pulled by India X. Thank you. That's what the message was. Nice, isn't it? A little bit of Grimace coin. What's the hottest sector in crypto? I gave you a hint earlier. It's me, man. Sun Pump buoys Tron's 24-hour revenue over Ethereum. Tron, as a chain, made more revenue than Ethereum in a 24-hour time period because they launched a meme coin launching platform. People want meme. They also want to create meme and scam everyone else. Little crypto hot potato, but within the crew, right? Dude, this is messed up stuff. But meme is still in the roost. Uh, metas in crypto refer to emerging narratives that may or may not be, be a flash in the pan. During this year and this current cycle, meme coins have trended across decentralized finance systems, including ETH and Tron now. Tron's meme coin craze began less than two weeks ago when Sun Pump debuted on August 9th as the first TRX based launch platform early days saw developers create two to three hundred tokens daily so for everyone out there telling me that crypto is going to go to zero mm -mm -mm, girlfriend no way what about this oh they're all going to go no listen to this hashed noted at least twenty thousand five hundred and four trx based meme coins as of august 21st dude this is insane people want to get in on the action and it's about meme all right, latest on Ripple, SEC. All right, here's the deal. There has been zero word from the SEC, and this is amazing news. You're not even getting a hint. I repeat, a hint 
of them. Now, Crypto Law put out a tweet that said, the law of the land, XRP and secondary market transactions are not securities. The SEC's ability to appeal to this status is non-existent. Honestly, every day that goes by is a day in our favor because it's the odds of the SEC appealing are less and less. Before I went online here, or live, whatever you want to call what I do right now, before I went on, I checked a bunch of prop betting sites regarding the SEC's appeal odds, and it is trending down, 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 which is great. Now, in terms of XRP price, is the is the appeal holding back the price? Ah, it's hard to say because honestly, you know, when you look at it, you're like, okay, 60 cents. I mean, I don't know, not bad. I mean, it's it's not full Torres pump on the on the penalties thing. Okay, cool. The SEC doesn't seem to be wanting to appeal, so you would think they would kind of bring up the markets a little bit, but it's it's not. It, it's not finalized yet. So will it hold back the price of XRP? Yeah, a little bit. I don't think it's the main factor, though. I think the main factor is just growth and development and usage, right? People want to see what is the juice, what is the usage. It's no wonder TRX has been hot lately. Well, why has TRX been hot? Because they are getting into meme. 20 thousand five hundred meme coins on and you can say meme is dumb as shit but it still brought revenue to the tron chain in fact so much revenue that tron made more money than the eth chain in a 24-hour period so it appears that the sec will not every day that goes on the odds are becoming less and less and less that the sec will appeal but we're also seeing that the market in regards to xrp isn't so much reacting to that news, but more broader global macros. And the crappy part is, is a lot of us were expecting for a lot more pump from tours than what we got. You sure as hell ain't going to get a super pump when that 60-day window is over with, right? So there's always going to be scammers, and there's always going to be a reason to get in BTC as long as governments are effing things up for us. Comment down below if your government is effing things up for you when it comes to monetary conditions. Now, in terms of XRP's price getting messed up because of the SEC and the appeal, look, I was nervous those first few days thinking Gare Bear is ready on it. As soon as Torres was going to make the announcement, Gare Bear was like, I'm going to bend you over. And that's not what happened. And in fact, as days go on, the appeal chances become less and less. And it makes you wonder if crypto really has now that political power to stop this kind of stuff. McHenry didn't stop it because he threatened Gare Bear all the time. Oh, don't make me be the first one to subpoena the SEC chair. And he never did. He threatened. But we're the voters and we're not threatened. We'll follow through. And maybe that's enough to keep Gary quiet. Because if the Democrats are over there going, look, we don't want to lose the crypto vote, let alone piss them off and have more people go against us then Gare Bear, you might want to be quiet and let those crypto bros and gals like have their fun. Politics in crypto, and crypto as a voice in politics, is growing. The SEC's chances of appeal are decreasing. Meanwhile, prices pretty much sideways. It's kind of like taking the math, right? The, the average of the two right there. But I want to hear from you. What's it going to take to propel XRP to do something? 60 cents ain't bad, but I mean, it's, it's also 60 cents. Like, 60 cents. I don't know. Let me know down below. And as always, Cody Coe's quiet. Choo-choo, bitches. No, I mean, really, Cody Coe's quiet.